Today's Olympic coverage of the 2016 Rio Games on NBC for New York is brought to you locally in part by United. One journey, two teams. United for over 35 years. Here you go. Can't wait to see what this baby can do. Thank you. Good morning. You remember my parents' anniversary? During Toyota's annual clearance event, lease a new 2017 Camry for just $179 a month or get $2,000 cash back on a 2017 Camry. Toyota, let's go places. Click for to watch for coverage from Rio. Severe weather could disrupt your weekend plans. Storm Team 4 will tell you exactly when and where this is going to hit. A solid clue police now have in the search for the killer of a Queens jogger. We are closely following this. And a child falls two stories from an apartment window in New Jersey. Hear from neighbors who saw it all. News for New York starts now. First, the event the whole world is watching. Good evening, everyone. I'm Sabila Vargas. Well, I'm Chuck Scarborough. For months, we've been counting down to this moment, and now it's here. The Rio Olympics have officially begun, kicking off with an elaborate display of history and culture of Rio de Janeiro. That's where News 4's Bruce Beck is live tonight. Bruce, here we go. I'll tell you, Sabila, the Rio Olympics are off and running. It didn't have the same amount of a budget as Beijing or London, but the opening ceremony was still spectacular, and it featured Brazilian culture, customs, and a kaleidoscope of colors. Before the opening ceremony, we talked to some of the fans, including one New Yorker who loves the game.